started chats up all right beautiful welcome everyone to my monday stream here as the united states of america and i do mean all the americas so still can't figure out what the tag is for this guy in order to return his core so i'm just gonna leave it alone at this point um my my lovely south american puppets are doing absolutely fantastic as far as i can tell at this point Mexico is still a bit of an issue, but I think we're going to solve that here in a minute with the Netherlands, who need a good kick in the face. And by a good kick in the face, I mean I'm taking on France and I'm taking on Russia at the same time with Germany, with Spain. So I figured out why these two allied me last time, and that's because I returned their core. So I gave Germany back this island and I gave Spain back Gibraltar. Now, so they allied me. Now... Basically, what this is going to do, so we should have... Oh, we don't! We don't have a dismantle CB on France? Why do I have a dismantle CB on... Huh. On the Netherlands. That's weird. And I don't have one on the Russian Empire, either. Strange. Okay, well, either way, just in case we do start dismantling stuff here, we're going to want to do some stuff. Um, so, number one... We're going to want to actually release the Mossy Kingdom here somehow, some way. We need to figure out how to do that. And the problem is I don't see not only the name, but their flag either. Like, unless this is it. But I don't think it is. Togo, Zambia, okay. So, let's see here. Three provinces, Doso, Limon... Okay, let's see. What is this? No, this is definitely not it. Whatever this is. Do we have one that says that? Oh, we have some bomb boy. <laughs> We also have Zambia. Oh, I think I know where that is. Okay. Yeah, so I just don't see them anywhere. Okay. Well, anyway, we are going to... Um, if we're going to go up against the Netherlands, we, we need a way to get this stuff at this point. Do we have the Kong Empire? I don't think we do. No, there's no way we do. It's a stupid kingdom here, this mossy kingdom. I don't understand. Nope, can't release that to become anything. Sinan? I think I saw that. Yes. Really? That's what you became? That's not what I expected. So what are you? Literally, you're a single... You're nothing. You're an absolute nothing there. Is that it? Say. Yep, that's it. Alright, so we're gonna go release Say. And I'm pretty sure they're just not gonna, it's not gonna pop. Whatever this is, is just not gonna pop. Because this is all, whatever this is. Okay. Wait, I never released Greenland? Well, that's interesting. Oh, 
Oh, that's right. I never released it. Duh, I know why. Here, you get you get stuff. Have a good time. So, yeah, we'll figure out what we can do here. So that's Ivory Coast. So we gotta make sure the Ivory Coast gets their stuff. We can take Guinea as a puppet. We basically have no infamy at this point, so we should be able to do this without an issue. So I declare war, dismantle nation. Germany will accept. Austria will accept. Or Australia will accept. Uh, all the other ones, yeah, those are the ones I'm worried about. All right, so we're gonna process that. Yep, dis dismantle it, declared. We have announced the world or intent to fully dismantle the country. This will not be easy. I disagree. Also, English patriots are over in uh, Cornwall. Oh well. All right, let's see what we get here. Really, China did said no. Spain said no. Norway said no. Malayan Federation, Island of Man, and Cornwall. All right, so Germany's totally all in on this. At that point, Germany's going to fight the Netherlands, France, and Russia by themselves. Spain's at war with me. Wait, what? Wait, why Why did that happen? Hold on, what? Oh, they were allied with the Netherlands. That's why. Oh, oh, I, I honestly don't care which way this goes at this point. I, I really don't. Now that I see this, I'm all over it. If I can dismantle Spain, that would be amazing. Okay, well, go, my vassal swarm, go. What you doing, Germany? Wait, did you not go to war? They didn't. Germany didn't go to war. I thought they went to war. Oh, well, this is a bigger issue now. Okay, hold on. How are we going to handle this? Oh, I think I know how to handle I know exactly how to handle this. I'm, I'm getting all that money from the British. Just sick, sick amounts of it. Ebelith, welcome. What a lovely evening it is. All right, you're coming with me. You guys are going to get together. Merge that. Um, bingo, mountain forest. I will take it. Is, oh god, that's the Caribbeans. <laughs> no, Papua New Guinea, I will not. Cool. My allies have a great time, you guys. Alright, so this is Mountain Forest. Oh, who did... I didn't even look. What's the guy landing? He has a negative one defense. Alright, that's awesome. Alright, everyone head back. Oh, I didn't realize he went all the way around. That's awesome. Really? That's just sad. Oh, we're a money hoarder again. Oh, we got $20 million. Oh. Oh, no. <laughs> Since I have so much money, um, oh, call ally for subsidies. I'm I'm literally gonna call all my allies in, and I'm just gonna give them all subsidies. England prevails. Hey, Leaf. Uh, can't stay with the stream, but big fan, long time, and starting. Uh, I'm starting in your world in conflict. Let's play. Oh wow, yeah, that's that was a good one actually. Um, yep, yeah, I'm gonna keep doing what I'm doing here. Don't don't you worry. I have no intentions of stopping. Uh, good of you to stop by. Oh, I don't have enough points, I see. Okay, we're going to need more points for that. Okay, that's fine. Grand Columbia, I want you in on this. Andes Federation. 
and La Plata. You're all in. Excellent. Yep, have a good night, you too. Um, yeah, and also it should be noted, I'm probably, because they, uh, Twitch changed the way the streams work, um, and you're allowed to stream apparently on YouTube at the same time again, um, I will be probably streaming on YouTube also simultaneously going forward after I get all this fixed. No, I'm not allying you. Can I even do anything with you? No, I don't even have a war goal for this. That's weird. Oh, what did I just kill? I killed something. Completely by accident, but I did it. Oh, I accidentally killed... <laughs> I'm accidentally killing ships. I love it. You know what? I'm gonna call the... I'm gonna call Israel in on this. Let's go, people. What do we need here? Uh, airplanes. Well, this is interesting. I'm curious what my allies are going to do now. So we got the dismantle on you, which is the key one I wanted. Can I do a dismantle on you? No, I can't. Can I justify? I could justify the free ally cores. Oh, apparently we're running a negative 16 or whatever. All right. Wait, what? Why, why can't I go there? Why can't I go there? Well, alright, we'll settle right there. This also has Mountain Forest with a plus three defense. I can do this too, AI. I can abuse my, uh, I can abuse mechanics as much as the next guy. So you guys landed there and you're just gonna sit around now? All right, well, you guys have a great time over there. I know I will. Yeah, everyone pay their debts. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. Oh, I accidentally retreated from a battle. Did not mean to do that. Okay, so this is weird. I'm in this battle, or I'm in this war, but nobody's, like, doing anything. Oh, there we go. There's, there's a hundred, uh, there's a hundred thousand guys. That's what I wanted to see. Positive one. Okay. This is what I wanted to see. Wow, they're doing, they're taking 800 and I'm losing nine guys. Whoops, I did not mean to do that. Now I'm taking negative, I'm taking a negative four there. I didn't mean to do that. That is not how I wanted to click that. Yep, I understand I lost. That's fine.
Okay, well, you guys are just sitting around up there. I really don't understand your strategy. Are you guys attrition -y? What's going on here? No, you guys just chilling. Okay. Well, that was, that's fun of you. Um, just, I don't know, have a good time. Ooh, Wall Street bombing. Demonstrating event has rocked Wall Street. Horse drawn wagon uh, traversed the street and stopped across the headquarters of J.P. Morgan Co. The financial district's busiest corner. Inside, 100 pounds of dynamite expo exploded, killing 40. Consequences of the shocking act reverberated throughout our society. Police inability to identify the perpetrator made many questions their capacity to ensure the public safety. Oh, beautiful. Uh, we've... Oh, I just killed a whole bunch of uh, another people from Netherland. Okay, uh, good for me. Didn't even realize I was doing it. <laughs> oh, I just realized that's the problem. France went to war with Russia, so they're not in on this. I didn't even realize the French did not join this war. So that means I only have to deal with Russia. Interwar cavalry. Um, with mass casualties suffering the Great War, the drawing of the modern, uh, the motorized era, age of the traditional horse cavalry was on its way out. New focus in the motorized. Uh, Motorization changed the way cavalry was to be used as well on the battlefield. No longer horse-mounted soldiers would be mounted instead on motorized vehicles. Motorization was also there for more firepower and heavier guns. Speed up deployment time. So basically, we have just converted our cavalry to motorized at that point. Oh god, and I got work stuff coming through. Oh god, okay, I'm not dealing with that. It's too late at night for me to care. Okay, so the question becomes, can I propose peace and get you out? No, I cannot yet. Can I go and level the Netherlands? I think I can. Oh, they're landing more guys. Okay, never mind. I'll let them, I'll let them do their thing. Our general died. Oh, no. Who else can I, like, dismantle their empire of? Nope, can't, can't there, can't here, can't there. So what gives me the ability to dismantle an empire is the real question. Also, um, I was gonna give war subsidies to everyone who was fighting for me. I better do that before people start going bankrupt. I'm just gonna, s like, the English are bankrolling me now for this. Allies, you want money? I'm an immense... Oh my god, I have $30 million. <laughs> Please, take the money. I don't need it. I don't need this kind of money. I will pay everyone in the world to fight. Oh, I just... I killed a lot of Spanish people. Alright, so... Can I free an ally corps? I can. United Providence of what? Spanish Equatorial Guinea. Sure, go nuts. Can we add another one? Um, doesn't look like I can do that. Okay. Oh yeah, they, here we go. Now it's really starting to settle in. Sure, they're right as always. Acceptable minimum wage. That'll piss people off. Yeah, it doesn't look like I can do another one. You will not accept this. United Province of Lido Prada from Spain. Wait, where? What? Isn't that this guy? Yeah. What does Spain have of theirs?
Equatorial Guinea. Isn't that this? Yeah. Why in the world do they have a core on there? Wait, is it so... Wait, the, La Plata? Yeah, La Plata has a core in Central Africa. Why? I'm very confused by this. Oh, Spain's running through my colonies. Okay, well, anyway. Um, propose peace. Can I... Um, it would not accept even though I have enough war score. Somehow I have, like, freaking 40 from you. I don't understand what the problem is. Cover the loss. Ah, Somalia, you're going to have to pay your debts here eventually. Cover the loss. Yeah, it's not really worth it. That's eh, a little more. Yeah, nothing's really worth it from the Spanish. That's eh, fine. Oh, my my military leader died. That's awesome. Oh, Mexico decided to join me over here. Oh man, I love these guys. Holy cow, Mexico! Um, opening the inner granite le lined leading t into the tomb. I was merely. I was met by breath of air that has not has been left undisturbed for some 3,000 years. The best of my knowledge, it was the first to disturb the pharaoh's sleep since he was laid to rest all those thousands of years ago. They were standing in ancient air and crypt. I felt the smell of wheat growing in the Nile, perfume of um, Auerbaskets flasks. I'm not sure if that's right. And a hint of drying for pomace. Uh, marvelous discoveries centuries have been made by English um, archaeologists working in the Valley of the Kings. Unknown tomb, 19-year-old Pharaoh Tukmin Han, or whatever. Heck if I know. Oh yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Alright, hang on, because the you just did something. Can I propose peace now? You will not accept. How do you how do I only have six war score on you? That's not right. Alright, you head back over there, please. Growth of the global economy in 19th century, early 20th century re, uh, resulted in increased demand on industrial goods by non-Western societies. However, the reliability of war, re, uh, well, war in industry age, increase in economic instability in periods of expansion and contraction resulted in non-Western societies at times being unable to meet their needs for industrial goods from traditional producers of such goods in the West. As a result, opening of producers in non-West society was met in the demand for those uh, industrial goods cannot be acquired easily from the West. The industrialization of non-Western world began to grow, eventually pa pressure to protect these new industries from uh, competitions from overseas that would lead some nations, which had maintained political independence to adopt policies and import subsidies. Uh, industrialization to encourage their societies to break the dependency upon the West for industrial goods, by extension the strength of their own societies in the global economic system. Boy, what a thing to say. Basically, we we unlocked oil and coal liquefaction plants. Wait, I didn't have oil before? That can't be right. That can't be right. Oh god, this this guy's going to go attack someone. Hey, get back here. Where'd you go? Fine, I'm just gonna go siege down Mab Madrid. Oh god, who are you at war with? Austria-Hungary? What are you at war with in Austria-Hungary about? What is this? Take the capital of Austria-Hungary? Screw it, I'm game. Let's do it. Can I can I add my own war goal to this? No, apparently not. Okay, well, anyway, I'm, I'm there in spirit, Germany. How about that?
Am I not? Is this not? Oh, I see. Oh, Spain's down here doing a number in my colonies. That's what's going on. I'm with you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna have to slaughter all your armies, aren't I? That should be giving me a plus four. Yeah, it does. Oh my god, look at that tick down. Look at that tick down. Great War experience. Get heavy armaments. Mexico, you want to, like, do something? Did the AI break here? Like, what's going on? Alright, took the capital. Wow. Alright, that's not ex exactly how I expected that going. Where's your new capital? What is that color? Oh! It just became straight hungry. Oh! That's... Huh! Not quite how I expected that to go. Interesting. So, they took the Austria part, and now it's just hungry. Um... Oh, got the dividends. Let me check something. Did... Those guys ever get built? I think they did. First pilot dropped a grenade on his enemy. The use of aircraft delivery munitions to the enemy was acknowledged to be a great tactical strategic value. To enhance and expand the abilities, dedicated bomber aircraft were developed. Of course they were. We are so smart as human beings. Ah, I see. You never actually, like, came together. Build two more from Minneapolis. Hey, hey. Minnesota for the win. Oh, God. My general died again? Oh. Alright, it wasn't that one. Mmm, party's work is not illegal. No, 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 no. We are not allowing that to go forward. White, 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 wide Cameroon. Why are you not in my sphere? You're still my puppet, right? Yeah, you are. Okay. Wait, oh, Russia- Russia's attacking me? Okay. <laughs> Interesting. Russia's attacking me down in China. That's a curious thing that just happened. Yeah, I can't even go there. That's interesting. Uh, do I have to worry about anything over here? It doesn't look like anyone's landed. Um, I did give you- yeah, I gave you full thing. So Mexico should be doing stuff. I would think. Add a war goal for Russia that makes any kind of sense? Mm, not really. Uh, I might have to just wait until 22 and get Germany involved in it. That's a person. Can I allow this to spread? Spain, you will ready to do this? All right, fine. I'll just keep sieging down your country. Hey, Nigeria. Welcome to the fold. I know you kind of were a dick, but let's see if you'll, uh... Oh, you won't do this. Dang. 
Yeah, I really should have saved them, is what I should have done. I should have made sure they stayed my, um, stayed my puppet. Um, oh, we invented National Socialism. Oh, great. Oh, minus 10%. Oh, God. That is terrible. And we invented a person. Mexico, you uh, having a great time? How are we going sieging down the Netherlands? Oh, you guys have problems again. Yeah, I think the AI is just, like, busted up right now. They can't figure out what it wants to do. Interwar inter inter infantry. From the end of the Great War to the end of the Depression, so many nations and armies kept evolving in the nature of focus. Starting with new divisional structures, many armies began to develop specialized units, ranging from marines to mountaineers, and a greater degree of uh, motorization, and the mass availability of cars and trucks, adding to the ever-changing nature of land units across the globe. Excellent. Alright, one thing we also need to do... Uh, we got time on it. I was gonna say, we need a puppet Brazil. But we got time. Spain, I'm not even asking for that much. There we go, alright. So, let me tell... <laughs> it did... Frickin' La Plata has colonies. They have a core here. What? Like, seriously, what? <laughs> Portugal, can I disable your empire? No? Well, that sucks. Um, where can I go that wouldn't, like, destroy my army? Alright, we'll just send you guys up here. Alright, whatever. Just go there, we'll figure it out. Um... That is a really big hungry, too. Like, I'm not entirely sure what to say to that. Wait, are they stuck there? Is that a sea zone they have to go through? Um, oh, French England didn't make any progress. Okay, that's fine. What in the world's happening here? You're... Why can't I leave this area? This is very strange. What is going on here? What are you? Union of South Africa wants military access. What are you in the middle of? Okay, you're at, wait, you're at war with Sudan? What is this mess? What did you, uh, England, what did you do? Ew. You absolutely disgust me, England. They're trying to take, they're basically taking their former colonies back, is what they're doing. But they absolutely disgust, disgust me. This is a bizarre world I've created here, that's for sure. Alright, well I gotta wait until Belgium decides they want to be part of this. English communists have risen up. I love this. That was a suicidal charge by the Netherlands. Should I force you to release Finland? Well, it won't be long until I get Germany involved in this mess. 
And Germany is a very scary Germany. This is a non... While this is a non-super um, Germany, this is a good-sized Germany. Better artillery, we'll use Great War Doctrine now. Oh, what in the world? Uh, oh. Prove living thaw, that's fine. Battle battlefield destruction doctrine. Battlefield destruction calls for air power to focus on the bombing front lines and enemy, mi enemy military units in close cooperation with friendly assault lines against enemy units. Okay, go nuts. Oh god, I am now an extreme money hoarder. I have $40 million on bank and it's not going anywhere. We get all this money from England that I don't want at this point. <laughs> God, let me do... What can I do with this money? Can I do anything? No, everyone's basically building stuff. Oh, God. Whoops. I can just give factories to everyone. Whoops, I guess that should be control. There you go. I'm going to give you all the railroads I can, please, for the love of God, just take them. I have so much money, I don't know what to do with it all. Where else can I dump money? Here you go. Australia, yes, you're my puppet. You can have all of this. Please, just take it away. Wait, New Zealand's a satellite of the Kingdom of Polynesia? Wait, what? How are you? Wait, what? <laughs> Who is that? Okay, whatever. I I can't. I just can't comprehend anymore. Here you go, Commonwealth of Philippines. Please, for the love of God, take this. The Netherlands is sieging down the Philippines. Okay. This is a thing. Philippines are sieging down part of the Netherlands. Okay. All your satellite of the Japan, have a great time. I don't care. Japan's just freaking powerful in this. Republic of China, you can absolutely have all of this. I don't care. lovely African nations. Hungary, you know what? Have all the railroads you want. Denmark, are you my puppet? No, you're not. Oh, I wonder if I can form Yugoslavia as the United States. That could be fun.
build all the railroads in all the places, trying to get rid of this money, and I'm, I'm barely, like, under it. <laughs> Don't even know what to do here. Like, just, this is ridiculous with the amount of money I have. Oh, perfect. All right, yeah, we're killing it. We're killing the Denmarkians. Not the Denmarkians. What am I talking about? The Netherlands. Yep, we are an immense money hoarder. Excellent. How long until I I get rid of this money? Oh God, another seven years. I think that's right. Actually, it might only be it might only be two. Oh my god. <laughs> They're sieging down Russia. Upper house rearranged. I love this. Oil changed. Okay. Are we sieging over here too? Nope. Annual dividends. I was wondering if they sent an army over here or something. That would be amazing. Naval firepower doctrine, while the focus on winning the decisive naval battle was important, it was also considered a valuable to use a variety of weaponry in order to achieve victory. In addition to the main armament, armament of capital ships, lighter warships were also important. They could dart in and launch deadly torpedo attacks, while secondary armaments was necessary to defend against these attacks. A balanced fleet, both capital and escort ships, was essential to victory in modern naval combat. All right, and excellent. We are now an extreme honey hoarder again. My god. Oh my god, they still won't accept. August 1922. Alright, so we got until August before we can call Germany in and finish this. Let's see here, in terms of... A fascist coup in Fiji! Awesome! I'm not worried about that. Okay, I'm not worried about any of this then at this point. Of all the places to have a fascist coup. Oh, I see that these are, um, being a thing. Where is this? Oh, no, once again, he sent an army into China to come and get me. Clean up some of these factories. Anti-aircraft artillery. In response to the increasing role of aircraft in armed conflicts, new methods and weapons were designed to counter the threat. Uh, dictated anti dedicated anti-aircraft artillery was a major step forward. Deep in the gun jungle, our archaeologists found an old steel of classic period. This is an artifact of a wonderful piece of art, but gives us a new insight into the ancient world of the Mayans. Free research points, I say. Oh, you know what I just realized? We just lost our money hoard. Excellent. Oh, thank God. We can actually start, like, ticking down these 40 million some odd dollars. This is a very fractured India, and I wish they would do something, but they're just not good enough. Oh, 
Oh, thank God. I can finally do something. All right, let's see if we can solve this problem. That over here. Oh! American scientists have found the skull of an old ape creature near the Tang uh, Tangu in South African territory. According to American scientist leaders, the whatever, uh, by reports could represent a viable candidate or ancestors of genus. Excellent. Tons of free research points. Siege all the Netherlands down, please. And let's see if we can get this taken care of. And excellent, thank you. And great war doctrine, all right. Behaviorism. Uh, what do we got here? Oh yeah, okay. Now, call ally, you will accept. Let's end this. Are you now gonna go after the Russians? Boy, look at that go. Crack down on those menaces. Chad, I don't want to be allies with you. Now, can I add a stupid war goal to you? Mmm, I could take your puppet. I could take Finland. Do I want to take Finland is the question. Let's say yes. I'm taking Finland. Are, are you vassalizing Finland? Yes, I am trying to vassalize Finland. Thank you. <laughs> You know, just for funsies, let's go vassalize Finland. Oh yeah, okay, this is what I like seeing. Late interwar bombers, advanced in aircraft designs, improvement in construction, improvement in aircraft engines are generally enhanced by the ability of bombers to accomplish their mission. Increase range, greater payloads, and better armament make bombers. Um, a much greater threat in combat. Excellent. Better planes. Oh, I had a guy in there the whole time? Wait, is that why I couldn't move with the ships? Oh, God. I might be an idiot. And by might be an idiot, I'm pretty sure I'm an idiot. Human wave versus sphere. For those armies focused on mobility, it was important to decide how precisely the army was, was to be mobile. One option was to use a standard infantry force and overwhelm the enemy with um, when contact was made. Another option was focused on a specialized spearhead unit, which often a mechanical component, best suited for mobility and quickly exploit weaknesses. For those armies focused on firepower, another crudal, critical decision revolved around how firepower was to be utilized. One possibility was to craft intern detailed plans and integrate artillery strikes on specific targets and times. Uh, they don't grow themselves. No, pacifism is junk. Um, time end justifies, and uh, just as a main assault was launched. Um, while another possibility was simply to mass, mass together as much artillery as possible. Yep, okay, gotcha. All right, let's get you guys out of here. We're gonna take over Finland. Oh, okay. Netherlands, would you like to, you will accept that. So let's get you out of there. Now it's time to defeat Russia, which they will accept. All right, so we have now puppeted Finland for, I don't know, reasons. Either way, we got Finland. Um, psh, sure. Oh, I can state China. Excellent. State to homie. Alright, so now that should dismantle the Netherlands. Do we have any problems with this? Oh, we do. Minimum wage movement. Holy cow, that was, that was getting up there. Dividends.
Finland, yes, we will be allies. You are my puppet. Yes, you are. Do you need any railroads by chance? No, but Norway does. Here you go, Norway. Have a good time. Wait, can I make... Um... Okay, I was going to say, was this going to pop up with letting me make Scandinavia? Because that would just be amazing. And where's my dismantling of the Netherlands? What's what's going on here? I did dismantle them, right? Yeah, I must have. Torpedo gyroscope. The inner uh, the invention turned torpedoes. Oh God. Um. Okay, so they're becoming they're becoming stuff. Uh, turn torpedoes into reliable weapons. Vastly decrease. God dang it, can Egypt. Malfunctioning by movements of water layers. Okay. Why am I getting the... I'm not getting the thing for the actual dismantling of the Netherlands, and I don't know why. Something bug out or something? Yeah, we got the Great War Capitulation. We're making 25 freaking K now. Is there a war happening I don't know about? Shanghai Treaty Port? Okay. Haven't I had you for a long time? Yeah, I've had you for like ever. And like ever, I mean probably close to a couple of decades. Is there a war happening I don't know about that's preventing this from triggering? No, there's no wars. What's going on? Dictatorship is not what it used to be. That's good. Well, we're communists. Awesome. Mm, no, I'm not going to be allies with you. Threat to the modern world, many communist factions. Oh, yep. Outrageous. We invent a person. Oh. Another person. We are a massive money hoarder. We have $40 million. Oh my god. Why am I not getting the notifications? Why is the Netherlands not being dismantled? What is happening? Alright, well I'm going to go ahead and remove you from my sphere. And I'm going to justify... Wait, I can free ally core from you? Ooh. What ally core... Wait, what ally core do you have? Hold on. Oh, I see. All this is claimed by a whole bunch of different people. Alright, well anyway, I'm just going to make you my puppet. So get on that. We're also going to go ahead and probably force through some reforms here in a little bit. And see what happens. I'm still really confused about why the Netherlands stuff isn't triggering. Armored cars? Armored cars fill a, war, a role not well suited for tanks or to regular infantry. Um, yeah, okay, that's fine. 
Uh, infantry mounted on trucks providing light vehicles and cavalry um, or police units. Armored cars could travel at speeds uh, over regular roads. Provide higher degree of firepower per vehicle. Excellent. And tank it. Experience wars. Ancient ru ruins of Borbeck. What is this? Oh, free research. Cool. Oh, around the Lebanese city of uh, Baalbek. Nice. Um, I'm debating whether to save it and reload it and see if that triggers the um, Netherlands to dis disband. Uh, value of usefulness of tanks, however, those who saw action tended to be a bit uh, unwieldy in rough terrain. Not very mobile. Tank kits were the first in the long line of development in tank technology allowing for greater speeds and better maneuverability. Alright. So hang on. Alright. Airplane. Airplane. Not, not. So that's at least... Alright, we need 10 airplanes in North America. All right, I am going to actually save it, and then I'm going to reload it and see if that triggers the Netherlands to uh, to start its thing, because I don't get why it's not. Well, it triggered this. Mass tank formations. By deploying tanks in mass formation, power can be concentrated and punch holes through enemy lines using overwhelming numbers and power. Infantry can follow the tanks that way can support advance and um, capture territory. Interwar fighters. Concepts of denying the enemy access to air above one's army discovered early in the budding air war. Aircraft were solely ro sole role was engaging in eliminating aircraft found in use their effects with bombers. All right. Let's go ahead and increase the pensions. Yeah, so I I fought the war to dismantle the Netherlands. It I they accepted and I got nothing. Um that's interesting. These guys turned fascist with their one population. Yeah, I really don't know what to say. Oh, this is a Congo Free State. Interesting. Anti-colonial rebels. Risen and spread democracy in every state. It was discovered... Oh, yeah, free. Do it. Oh, we were discovered. Well, that sucks. Oh, it's... Alright, well, that did a thing. Yeah, I do not understand. How long is this good for? 33. Okay, well, I guess there goes that opportunity. Oh, nice. Extradition granted. Um, yeah, I, I truly don't understand what's happening. All right, let's go ahead and release some of these uh, African nations at this point. Mm. Not seeing him. Okay, well, that's a thing. Uh, release Togo. There you are. Benin. We can go ahead and hang out up there. Do I have another army hanging out anywhere? It's not like we're stuck territorial-wise, is it? I don't think so. Oh. Philippine reactionaries, get out of here. Hmm. 
Oh, excellent. Republic of China and the Republic of China are going at each other's throats. Oh! Oh, good lord. Oh, good lord. Ch oh, no! Japan's gonna puppet all the Republic of China. How in the world did this mess happen? Oh, uh, hold on. What? Uh. Oh, God. Okay, hang on. Light tanks. Major step forward in tank technology. Light tanks generally mounted machine guns or light guns were used as true tanks to be produced. Used in infantry support war. Tanks gave divisions much needed um, uh, mobile firepower to solid defense capabilities. Alright, what's his crisis? Yeah, that's a big fight. Okay, I gotcha. Um, but I wanted to back these guys. I wanted to free them. Oh, they're just straight up Indian reactionaries running all over the place. Yeah, I don't know how this is gonna go. Probably not that well. What's their military power? Oh, 17 of 30. Yeah, no, Japan has this. On the flip side, though, that's a big Republic of China. They might be able to become a great power and actually break free. Oh, yeah. Um, let's see. Who are you? I think that one was one that I could not release. Yeah, I had nothing with O in it. What about you? What are you? Kong. Kong available? I think Kong. Wait, that's Congo or Kong? Oh, no, it's Congo. Okay. Go ahead and release Congo. There you go. Have a great time. Oh yeah, and here's Zambia. Okay, we can release Zambia. Oh, that's a pretty good size Zambia, actually. I don't think I was expecting it to be that big. Yeah, and that one doesn't have a core. Uh, what was this, Namidia? Yeah. Botswana. And then I have no core right here. So that that's just mine. year. 10% craftsman in Maryland. Alright, go ahead and make me craftsman. Oh my god! Whoops, not paying attention. I got 30% craftsman there. I have 8% clerks around here? Holy crap, this is double what they normally are. Expressionism. Alright, I don't think we can release anything else unless it's going to be Madagascar, which I don't want to do. Uh, what is this? Oh, the Malayan Federation. Oh, yeah, that's right, and I have Indonesia right there. Excellent. Make a puppet of Brazil. Yeah, I'll give you working hours.
you can come in and I'll give you war subsidies. I have 40 million dollars and nothing else to use them for. Oh wow, look at Grand Columbia. Okay. All right, everyone get on it. Oh yeah, it's not looking good for the Republic of China. On the flip side, Japan probably has most of their stuff over here in the ma in the main islands. I will, in fact, ally you. I'll let this happen. Oh, literature, late interwar fighters, uh, never-ending cycle of advance in one area lead directly to advance in another. Dedicated fighter aircraft who roll and engage enemy aircraft gain advance Advantages from the same source as bombers in response to advantages in bomber aircraft. New engines, better design, improved signals, and improved guns. Yep, that sounds like something. Oh, the Republic of Congo has become a dictatorship. Well, alright. Revolt of the masses. I'm not reading that. Um, we invent a person. Light artillery experience from the Great War demonstrated that infantry units, especially those operating in rough terrain, need a viable option to increase firepower. Traditional guns were were too heavy, too bulky, used effectively to move um, rapidly in uh, adverse conditions. Short range guns of smaller caliber, easy to move by horse, vehicle, or manpower were developed and filled in the so-called mountain guns. All right, we're gonna go ahead and take care of these. Probably gonna need to get some tanks in these things here pretty soon too. Alright, so that's not quite done. Alright, let's watch this happen. Social responsibility, please. We invented a person. Uh, where's all your troops there, Grand Columbia? Where are all your troops? Did you like shove them over here or something? The navies are definitely fighting. Decline of the West and the Wasp Generation. Again, not reading that mess. Oh, Sierra Leone became a thing. Has that always been a thing? That might have been kicked away from the British. God, what did we discover here? Well, first off, um, worker safety. I'll give you that. Um, don't know who this is. Anthropologist. Why do you consider one of the most important modern anthropologists and influence in the structure of fundamentalism? So sociology is pioneering whatever, made major contributions to study of whatever. Diplomatic influence, shared prestige. Medium artillery. Coming out of the mold of traditional artillery, artillery, combined with the experience of the Great War and rapid increase in motor, motorization, medium artillery gun was developed. Of modest caliber, these guns were standard and regular infantry units, uh, providing them with greater uh, firepower and capability of uh, mobility they had previously lacked. 
And we're no longer an immense money hoarder. That's good. I see Albania became a thing. Oh, yeah. Republic of China is just getting their butt beat now. Yeah, they're, they are losing hard. But, like I said, they're in a position they could probably become a great power, or the click can. Wait, where are the rebels? Oh, okay, gotcha. Yeah, that's fine. You guys can deal with that. And if you can't, I'm not worried about it. Modern design, the rise of modern industrial spaces. Well, that's a little curious. Oh, I see. Uh, rise of modern industrial practices in the increased availability of raw of new raw materials for construction uh, for this new school of architecture design would evolve the 20th century um, would mark a radical break in the definition of style of the past falling upon victims form follows function a new um, function architecture designed based around clean lines vertical and deliberate lack of orientation would come to the fore and work in architectural lanes whatever a whole bunch of prestige and why are you guys losing? I gave you all the money in the world to do this. Grand Columbia, where is your army? Get in on this. Four subsidies. Firepower versus mobility. After the end of the First World War, major powers had reevaluated their military strategies in light of brutal lessons learned during the years of trench warfare. Uh oh, what is this? Italy? Well, that looks like it was a really stupid thing to do, Italy, but I'm going to be involved in it. Um. One major school of thought was the emergence of focus on importance of using mass firepower principally in the form of artillery. Overwhelm the enemy literally blast holes in the line to facilitate an advance. Why another school of thought suggested the key to victory on the modern battlefield was mobility. And so friendly forces can maneuver around the enemy's strong forests and attack a more adventurous terrain. Okay. Alright, well you guys have just loads of fun with this. I could call Germany into this, but... Honestly, I'm at the point where I almost want to dump all European alliances and just be done with them. Like, no more European allies whatsoever. We invented Jazz. You know what? We're going to do that. Dissolve Alliance. Thank you. Oh, the Netherlands are at war with Italy, too. This is great. France, where, what are you doing? Where's your army? Oh, technically he has a bigger army than you. Okay, well, that's fine. I'll let you lose. No, Germany. Oh my god! What? Reale Core Ganaya? Oh my god, that's 70% war score. Look at what this encompasses. I don't see those cores though. That is insane. Yep, looks like looks like Italy won. They got Corsica. That's fine. Um, France, I am dissolving your, my alliance with you. All right, new rule: no more European alliances. End of story. Oh, oh, that is a big Japan. That is a very big Japan. 
definitely not getting involved over there. Honestly, I'm I'm gonna build railroads. Social realism. Oh, 1925 tornado outbreak. 1925 is an unusual demonstration for years of tor tornadoes, and one particular, the so-called tri-state tornado, carving a line of destruction 200 miles long across uh, Indiana, Illinois, and Missouri. Nearly a thousand have been killed. Millions of dollars of damage have been reported. Entire communities have been smashed to pieces by the storm. Other smaller twisters led to dozens of deaths across the Midwest and upland south. Multi-state cleanup effects have been launched with the governments of the states most affected the outbreak deploying uh, deploying your National Guard in the survey assisting in rebuilding efforts. That sucks. Great Gatsby? Okay, we, we invented a piece of literature and social realism. Okay, there's a fascist dude color on Vantatua, whatever. Uh, Japan being my new bestie. They would not accept. Negative relations. Oh, that's fine. I could work with that. Um, honestly, no. I kind of want to hit Japan also. But what I want to do is get their puppet here up to a point where they become a great power. And so they're no longer the puppet of Japan. And then I want China and Japan to just fight it out. I'm holding down the wrong key. Because it should not... It, they're number 10. They shouldn't be, like, a crazy amount off. Oh, they are a, a pretty decent amount off, actually. Never mind. They could hit you. Yeah. <laughs> I wonder when that's going to happen. Hang on. Let me go forward deploy the uh, the U.S. Navy to Pearl Harbor. That'll teach, that'll teach Japan a lesson about trying to mess with the United States as I go build forts on Hawaii. <laughs> All right, 12 no zero fries in uh, physics. Nice. Wow. Expressionist art. Yeah, Brazil wants a, they want a lot of war score for not a lot of stuff, that's for sure. Uh, let's ump our pensions. And yeah, I guess we'll invent what hyperinflation is, even though it's completely pointless. Oh, 1925 San Barbara earthquake. On June 29th, a violent earthquake struck Southern California, causing 13 deaths, 44 uh, and 44 a.m. What does that mean? With the epicenter being located in the coastal city of Santa Barbara, there was much of uh, Santa Barbara destroyed. Further disaster prevented a historic action of three citizens who shot off the town's gas and electricity, preventing the fires. Nice. And, okay. Oh, the exact same thing, but in Montana. Interesting. All right, well, once this war is done with Brazil here, um, we're going to call it for a night. Anti-colonial rebels. I love it. And it almost looks like I need to beat the crap out of, um... Beat the crap out of, um, England again. Okay, good. I'm going to give you military access. Take military access. Expressionist literature, surrealism, and some dude. All right, cool. All right, so this is fantastic. Um, I have American Australia here. Still can't do anything. Why not? Oh, we still have a truce. When's that truce up? 28. Okay, so we got three more years. So, yeah, okay, I see, I see. Gotcha. Okay, so this is a pretty fantastic playthrough, I will say, so far. Um... This is, this is a thing, like, I don't even know what to do here. This is a very dangerous Japan, um, sort of thing. I did, as stated before, dismantle, oh, what's going on with this? Oh, okay, <laughs> Italy's being the crap out of Hungary. I did dismantle the Netherlands, but it, the pop-up never happened for it, so I don't know what to say to that.
it's really unfortunate. I was really hoping to kick Indonesia out of this, and they could start growing into a great power. But, all oh well. This is a really kind of messed up playthrough, too. Looking at that Germany and this Hungary. Italy's going to start taking chunks out of Hungary. I think they're going to get cannibalized. England's still a very powerful nation, despite the fact that they've been beat the crap. Beat to crap. Turkey over here. Being Turkey, but that's a whole nother story. Like, I love the fact that Liberia, uh, Li uh, Libya exists, but Italy, Italy Libi <laughs> Libya also exists um, in there. And I don't know if there's anything else I have the ability to actually, like, disassemble at this point. So, whatever. I got all, I released all the African nations I really could at that point, and they're free to do their own thing at this point, so go nuts. All right, so we'll come back on our Wednesday stream. That will probably be the last stream we're going to end up doing of the United States here. Um, and I'll make sure to do I images of the entire spheres and everything when we when we get around to it. But, yeah, I don't know what to do next at this point. Um, so we'll see what happens. So I will see you guys for the Wednesday stream. I thank you guys for watching, and I will catch you guys later.